come back to my channel. A long time in a sooner. A long time in a sooner. A long time in a year from you now. But I miss you now. Not tell no lie. And to be honest, me thank you God for all of the supporters that I have been supporting me throughout the two months to three months that I've started to post. I've reached a long way and I'm on my way to 1k but with the full help me no say I'll be be reaching there in no time but that's not what I'm gonna talk about today if you can see down the look below the title I'll be telling you a story time on how I met my true love I describe it as my true love because we have been through a lot and when I'm saying I've been through a lot, I have been through a lot, to hell and come out back. You understand? So, let's go right into the video. Let me tell you now. <laughs> it's a long story, you know. I just don't want to tell you no lie. I just want to be really honest with you. But, I think it was in July. July when I was added to a group on WhatsApp. So you know sir, you know the group on WhatsApp consists of a lot of persons who you don't even know. And you just added by a friend. So that was the case. I was added by a friend or a former friend that me used to talk to. So when I was added to the group when I reached into the group now the group was really silent. Nobody wasn't talking. Nobody was saying a thing. So, in my head, I was saying, to me get out to the group now, nobody don't want to talk. Nobody don't want to correspond. So, I just pull a trick and say, oh, I'm going to text on the group. So, I text on the group and say, hi, everyone. So, everybody seeing it, nobody respond. So, Two minutes later now, I see one number coming at the group and say, You know what? I'm going to leave the group. And I said to the per I said to the girl, Why are you going to leave the group? Why? Then she responded and said to me, Because nobody is responding or nobody is not corresponding in the group. None at all. So, but he said, I said, No, I'm going to inbox her. But I did not jump into the girl inbox. I asked her, I said, can I inbox you? Then she said, why? So I said, I just want to inbox you. You know them style. So I got the permission to inbox her and I did inbox her. When I inbox her now, you don't know something, you don't know the person, the person don't know me. So when I inbox her now, she said to me, say, I said to her, say, yes, I said, so I said to her, say, Send me a picture. She sent me a picture. So friend, she sent me the picture, guys. I said, no, man. You really look nice. I start complimenting her. I said, you look nice. And etc. So right there, I said, no, man. I forget that person. Yeah. I forget that person because the person look really good. So, when I said that, I said, I start working and thing until it became... Close friends. When we say close friends, I mean close, close friends. And we began to talk and we get to know each other inside and out. We start share some personal stuff. But we never imagined would I really share with persons like that. So, one month gone now, we became best friends. So, from friends, from from strangers to friends to best friends. So that are street that are one, two, three steps. So when we become when we became best friends now, you know so best friends level different from friendship from friends. So the best friend level was really and truly high. What what we mean by it was really high? We share a lot. We had each other back. You know. When so when one of us 
want a shoulder to cry on. For instance, I want a sh shoulder to cry on. I can always call upon her and she's always available. Even if she's busy, she will, she will be available for me. So, when we became best friends now, as I said, we, we talk and we call each other, we laugh, we run jokes. You understand? So, we started to date in August the 15th. When I told her that I was coming to Kingston, because she lived in Kingston. First, she was really and truly shocked. She's, she was really and truly shocked. To the point she was questioning me about it and saying, You really? A true you attack, a true you attack. But the way how we, date, we start dating you now, it is very weird. Because none of the both, none, neither me or she, never come to agreement and say, We're going to start it to date. It just happened sudden. It just happened. Because during, during the friendship and between friends to be best friends, none of we never come to agreement and say, no, so we like each other. It just happened. So, I don't really look funny now, because you know, things always happen in a mischievous way. So, I accept it and she accept it too. And when I told her that I was coming to town now, she was really happy, and I was really happy. I was really happy. You understand? I was really happy. So, the day when I come up, the day when I come up, we finally met. And when we met the day, you know, it's like it was like a, I told her the Saturday, and I came up the Sunday. And when I came up the Sunday, I was actually going into the same community that she was in. And I was really and truly shocked, guys. I was really and truly shocked. I was really and truly shocked. To the point where tears come in my eye and I say, wow, this is really weird. Nobody knew. I didn't know. I didn't know. Nobody knew that... This would happen. When we met, you know, we hug and we started to laugh. We started to giggle like we know no sense. We started to steer. I couldn't, I was speechless. Only thing I could do was to look from head to toe. I'm like, is this really you? And to be honest, you know, the picture that she sent me and seeing her in person is the same person. It was the same person. It is the same person. It was the same person. Until now, from, from August the 15th, 2017 till now, 2020, we're still pulling through. And that's six years now. Six years, six long years. So guys, it's never it's when when I meet somebody and I just start date, dating without you guys even ag have an agreement and say we're going to be in a relationship. Trust me. Unexpected relationship, it's the best relationship ever. It's the best. So guys, it's another a good woman or man coming on the life hold on on them hold on on them because at the end of the day at the end of the day you and that same person have been going through hell people try to break up on you yes people are got always bad mind the relationship because what them seeds say the relationship are going strong. It has a strong bond. And no matter what them do. Or no matter what them say. Nothing now going to happen. Because what? We going to have each other like that. We going to have each other tight. You understand? So. It's been six years now. 
and I am really and truly happy to be honest. Me now say the relationship is perfect. No, it's not. It has we have up and down. We have up and down. So unexpected relationship are the best to me. To be honest to me. It is it is to me. It is. To be honest, it is. So, if one have a good partner, we'll learn from them. Come from. Hope you understand that. So, big up on yourself. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And I'm out. Love you guys. Keep on supporting me. Just keep on supporting me. I really appreciate it. Appreciate it a lot. So, big up on yourself and out. Peace.